Hello child boxes out there, today in this video I'm going to be telling you guys all about what I got to on my Friday, Saturday, Sunday of this week. On my Friday I got out after a nice long line, definitely needed that as my sleep pattern has just been out the window at the moment and I then got up, I had some toast and a cup of tea for my breakfast, me and my mum were then just watching a bit of Mud She Wrote and me and my mum were just then listen to a bit of music, I played on Subway Surfer. My dad had work, so did my older brother and sister. The younger sister's in uni, and my younger brother was off with my dad to look at a new card he was hoping he was to be getting. And my dad had got him after being at work, and then they got off to look at the car. And I then was just listening to a bit of music, watching the TikToks, doing a bit of coloring in, and working on a little book short story thing I'm working on at the moment which is going really well this is on notes on my phone I was then watching some vlogs and just some stuff on Disney Plus and Netflix and some stuff on Call Duty to watch and watch some muppets of friends and then I got myself ready and went off for a massive walk and the weather has been so lovely at the moment lovely blue skies so sunny perfect weather for lockdown when there's not much else to do and I was on my walk and got loads of lovely snaps and I show and I show you guys some of those now. I was then on my way back and I got called up from home and I was like, oh god. I hope mum's alright, so I, I answered it and she was like, oh yeah, your gra I was all right. your grandma's made a Victoria sponge cake and wants you to go round so you can get a bit of the cake. So I then went round, kissed by the door and had a nice catch up with my grandpa's and she gave me a tub of Victoria sponge cake and I got home, the precious cargo, and I'm so clumsy, I was like, I do not want to drop this. And she even said so herself, she's like, make sure you don't drop it. I got back and had a bit of that with a cup of tea and watched a bit of the sketch country and just a bit of cream and I'm going to show you guys the photo of the cake now. It's so soft, literally heaven in a bite. She does such amazing Victoria sponge cakes. Posted that onto Instagram and some of the fluff stuff that I got while on my walk. And then I watched the Aussie Six wrote a bit of my journal, worked on some illustrations and coloured in some of those. My dad and younger brother then got back from looking at the car and he only went and bought the car. It's a nice black one, very nice looking, very fast and he is so happy with the new car, bless him. And then my older brother got back from being at work. I then finished watching all these soaps, did some colouring in and listened to a bit more music. It's a bit of Kate Bush, a bit of Coldplay, a bit of Seagulls. 1975 and then in the evening me and my older sister and her my older sister her boyfriend and my older brother and the pooch went for a walk and it was very lovely lovely evening stroll and i'm going to show you guys one photo i got i know normally i get loads of photos but this time around i just got one and it was off this lovely sunset that we had and i'm going to show you guys that photo now A lovely evening and um, we popped around to our family friends just outside and their dog is a sausage dog which is so adorable he's still a puppy and him and Harvey our boxing colleague got on really well and they were just running around the front garden like headless chickens and then we continued on our walk and didn't go much further because we were having takeaway for tea and it was going to be arriving soon so we didn't want to be up for too much longer we then got back home, my older sister and her boyfriend then went off home and we had takeaway, I had a kebab, lamb kebab, which was so good. Then I finished my episode of my journal, put that away and then watched the UK soaps. And then I was watching a bit of Ugly Betty on Disney Plus Star. It's updated now and it's got so many shows on there now. So I've just been watching lots of that, like we watched Brothers and Sisters on there that I've not watched in ages. And Boy Meets World. And yeah, it's just such a great site. Definitely been keeping me sane during lockdown. Not much longer. Back to work in May. Can't wait for April 12th, my mum's birthday, when things are slowly going to be getting back to normal. Can't wait to be able to get my hair cut. My hair is being crazy. Although I'm actually quite liking 
how it's looking at the moment. So depending on how I feel when the barbers do eventually open on the 12th of April, I will be getting my haircut. Definitely need a shave too. And then I was listening to a bit of music, doing a bit of colouring in and some drawing and worked on some illustrations. I then went off to bed and I then got up for my Saturday. I had a really nice long line, not much else to do and not got nowhere to go. So I was just like, I'll just have a bit of a lazy morning. Just didn't want to get out of bed to be honest. And I was just scrolling through TikTok, checking on my socials, messaging some of my mates online, listening to a bit of music. I then eventually got set up got downstairs, made myself a cuppa and had some toast. My mum did go up and we just watched a bit of TV and we watched this Jane Austen documentary. Bloody love Jane Austen. And interesting fact, my uncle almost moved to a house near to where one of Jane Austen's houses was, which is awesome. And I have had a bit of writing fog at the moment. So I've just been trying to get back into writing and I listened to a bit of Kylie and then for my lunch i had some banana sandwiches didn't knock it to try it it is the best one of the best sandwiches ever and had a cup of tea my older brother had gone for one he got back and was just on his xbox and was being very loud and very crazy my younger brother was out enjoying his new car riding his car out in the countryside testing it out and is loving his new car, bless him. Old sister was at hers, younger sister is at uni. And then my older brother went and took the dog for a walk. I was still having my lunch at the time, so I thought you go out and head. And then he got back. My older brother was then just getting ready to just sort some stuff out for work. And my younger brother got back and my dad got back from the shops. And then I went off for a nice evening stroll and he went off and got his vaccine so now my mum dad and grandparents have had their first lot of the vaccine which is a relief and i'm just so chuffed that he's had that done now and i'm going to show you guys some of the photos i got while on my walk Way back from my walk I got called up by my older brother and he was like can you get me some brown sauce please no he wanted barbecue sauce and I got the shots and I accidentally got him brown sauce instead of barbecue sauce so I got back across he was kicking up he's like oh you got me the wrong sauce easy mistake done and then I got some shrimp I absolutely love shrimp and banana probably the banana a lot more than the shrimp but they're equally as good and yeah I got some of these and a banana yazoo Got back and had some of my shrimp banana and a bit of my banana as you. I was chatting to one of my work clothes on Facebook, have a nice chat shirt with her. And I just can't wait to get back to work. I miss my work around so much. And I then was just listening to a bit of music, wrote a bit of a journal, worked on some illustrations, and then for tea, we just had this chicken bacon thing that wasn't the best. I'm not a big fan of it, but starting to eat because grown boy got it got to eat my food and I then was watching The Voice and Casualty and listened to a bit of music, watched a bit of Sister Sister and a bit of Ugly Bessie and Boy Meets World. Almost finished that and I'm going to be done watching Girl Meets World. And then I was just messing around on TikTok, uploaded a few TikToks. I don't care about likes, watches, unfollowing, unlikes, all that kind of crap. I'm just done. I'm not letting it get to me and yeah i'm gonna try anyway i'm a bit of an obsessive personality so i get obsessed with stupid little things like that that really i shouldn't be getting obsessed with but yeah i'm just crazy like that so i love me and then i was just watching some vlogs and some tiktoks listened to a bit of music and then went off to bed and then it is now sunday i hope you guys are having a lovely sunday having a lovely sunday rest i got up had a nice fresh shower got changed had some toast and a cup of tea, some raisin bread toast, lots of butter, 
delicious and my older brother had made himself some pancakes didn't make me any the cheeky sod and my dad was out cleaning the cars as it's another another beautiful sunny day and older sister is at hers younger sister is at uni i facetimed her the other day to have a nice catch up with her can't wait to be able to see her again missing her lots older brother had gone to the shops he got back and it's just on his xbox younger brother is just watching the girlfriend's box set he's obsessed with girlfriends at the moment and i was just listening to a bit of music working on new illustrations and while i had my shower early on we've got a new shower head and i didn't realize how powerful it actually is so as i was having my shower it literally went wild and i thought the bathroom was going to be like flooded and it did get a bit there's like a massive puddle on the floor so i had to get a towel and quickly mop that up and yeah it's a really lovely refreshing shower once i got the hang of it it was actually quite relaxing when trying to sort out the new shower head and yeah i got it sorted out now and i wrote a bit of my journal and just just been doing a bit of coloring on the coat on my friend which is super therapeutic loving that and the photography i've been getting at the moment i've just been loving all the flowers that are blooming now i've seen so many rose buds and stuff that i'm just like i can't wait for those to bloom so i can get a photo of those and during lockdown i've just found it so therapeutic and it's just helped me so much to be able to go out and get some photography and just get out for my walks and keep me busy and yeah it's, it's been a really positive way of keep, it's keeping busy and i am now off to go have my lunch just got some jam sandwiches and a cup of tea to have and then me and my older brother sister and the pooch and i think my older sister's boyfriend as well are going to be going off for a nice walk and make the best of this lovely sunshine that we're having and i shall see you later on with a bit more of the vlog bye back from being on my walk i had a really nice time on my walk with my older brother sister and the dog loving the sunshine it's been so beautiful at the moment and i'm going to show you guys some of the photos i got while on my walk photos while on my walk we dropped my older sister back to hers and then my older brother and the dog had gone off him and i continued on my walk because i only got a few photos at the time so i got some more and then bumped into one of my actually was it yeah two of my mates from touch rugby and one was just far behind who i hadn't seen at first as they were there walking their dogs and i then got home I uploaded the photos that I got while on my walk onto my social medias. I just messaged to my mates on Facebook and just drawing a bit, work closely with illustrations, listened to a bit of drawing and doing a bit of colouring in and was playing on some of myself a bit and my younger brother and older brother on the Xboxes and then we had our tea and we had a chicken roast which was so delicious and I'm going to show you guys a photo of that now. so good i didn't have to tidy away and i finished writing my journal and put that away and early on i got a photo of the cat out in the garden looking like a tiger she's so adorable and i'm going to show you guys a photo of that now bless her she's fitting in so well i can't believe she's eight months old now i then just been doing some drawing, just a bit of music, a bit of Coldplay, a bit of 1975, a bit of Kate Bush, and I had some raisin bread and a cup of tea, and I'm now off to go and watch the new That's a Nice episode. I hope you guys have all had a lovely weekend, or have a lovely rest of your Sunday evening and a great weekend. I shall see you with a new vlog coming very soon. Bye.